The Wallet Agriculture Livestock Station, currently in Phase 1, will see the development of approximately 30 acres of land, where its operations will focus on growing the livestock industry in tangible ways once completed. Works remain ongoing in the construction of the roads and drainage infrastructure, two swine units, a rabbitry, two small ruminant pens, a warehouse for storage for feed and equipment, and a building for the stockmen. Prime Minister Honorable Alan Chastney says the new station will enable the production of breeding stock for farmers, enabling them to multiply and sell to butchers. This is really a research center, and so we now have purpose-built buildings to facilitate the development of livestock in, in different areas. And also the idea of expanding it now to be also crops. Um, so again, we uh, have a policy of focusing on seven crops. We want to be able to find the seedlings um, and, and the harvesting of those crops uh, that can produce the greatest amount of yields. So a facility like this, that is what this will be done. So not only in terms of breeding livestock that we believe is more compatible and can generate more productivity for um, uh, the, uh, the farmers and the butchers. Um, that this is where this is going. So I'm very excited today to see um, the amount of investment that's been put in so far and the infrastructure that's been put in, the road network internally, um, each of the individual buildings here, the administrative building, and we're building a world-class re agricultural research center. Parliamentary representative for Mekud North, Honorable Dr. Gail Rigabat, is expectant of the myriad of opportunities for farmers in the constituency, as well as youth who may be interested in the agriculture sector. The Vollet Agriculture Station will be another milestone achieved by the Agriculture Ministry in making the local agriculture economy more viable and competitive. So I think finally we've found a space where not only the Ministry of, Edu uh, Ministry of Agriculture could continue with its research and development, but to be in the vicinity of farmers, given that the farmers are in such close proximity that they can benefit from that interaction with your technocrats so as to improve on yields, production, etc. Importantly as well, I trust that a facility such as this will afford constituents employment opportunities and I know that we have some young agriculturists, for example, who would have graduated from Sir Arthur Lewis, some of their first degrees are looking excitedly towards the completion of this project. Some of the services to be offered at the Volet Agriculture Station will include animal health advisory and treatment services provided by livestock extension officers and veterinarians to facilitate improved livestock production. Quarantine officers and veterinary public health officers will also be on hand to ensure all food safety requirements are met. From the Information Unit of the Department of Agriculture, I am Anisia Antoine reporting.